Okay, so each one of these constructions are a specific drawing. The first one, we are going to be drawing congruent segments. Let me grab my pen. Congruent segments. So whatever I write, write what I write. Ooh, that was crooked, sorry. Congruent segments. Um, congruent means the exact same length or same size. So a congruent segments would be the exact same length. So this length would be the same as this. And that's what we're doing. I do. I did not. Yeah. Okay. By the way, if you have trouble with printing from Schoology, try downloading the document first, then printing it, because sometimes through Schoology, the formatting gets messed up. I don't know why. Okay, so we have segment AB right now, right here. We're going to draw a segment congruent to that, meaning the same exact length. First thing we need to do is label a point R. So draw point R. Are you serious right now? Who's that? Okay. Okay. So now we need to measure the distance between A or A and B with our compass. So adjust your compass so it's the length of AB. And then make a little arc at B. So you're measuring the length between AB and then making an arc at B. Whoa, I didn't realize it wasn't in the frame. Okay, so measuring the distance between AB, making an arc at B, and then taking that same measurement, putting this on point R, and making an arc. Then, as you may predict, you have to connect point R to that mark. And then this will label point S, and so AB is congruent to RS. Okay, now we're going to practice that another four times, so I'm gonna walk through it again. So here's segment AB, we're making a segment congruent to it. So first step, point R. Then measure the distance between A and B, so adjust this so it's that distance, and make an arc at B. Then at R, make that same mark. And then just connect it. Yes. Can I get a new one? Yeah, sure. Trade it out. That's fine. Yes. What's that? You might be able to adjust it, no? You can get one of these if you like. Okay, number two, same thing, point R. Measuring the length between A and B with the compass, making an arc at B, and then taking that same measurement, putting it on R, and making that same arc. Then three, same thing, point R. Measuring the distance between A and B.
putting this on our then use your ID or whatever straight edge you have. If you freehand it, it's very obvious. And I will take out points, don't freehand.